This guest house is called Father and Son Guest House. Like, how coincident is that? I think I might have stopped recording, so I gotta go through this spiel again. Kurt's in there making use of the restroom. We got our own private bathroom. You can hear him in the background. And we got two beds, our bags, and a little window. So we have struck gold. We got our own shower. So we're gonna come off with the uh, quick dries, on, off with the boots, and showers, and it is gonna feel so good. I have never felt so tired. I've lost weight. My pants are like falling off of me where they were comfortable before. Hey, Kurt, man, how are you feeling? Long day, huh? Yeah, mine are like friggin' uh are they all wet? Mm. Not as bad as yours, but yeah. yeah, I think we should switch out socks. Yeah, see how mine are doing, hang on. Socks got so wet they were swishing in sweat. So unfortunately, I changed them about two hours back. Glad I did that. Uh, things look a lot better. They were pretty freaking wet. I've got a like major blister. You can see. Uh, and I popped. I've been trying to keep echo bag uh, antibiotic stuff on it. Here it's all worn away. It hurts like hell. My boots were chafing into my leg. Um, oh, my mouth looks good. Uh, it's a little wet. So we just have to be careful and uh, start changing our socks halfway through the day, I guess, if they're sweating, because otherwise you can get a trench foot for feet if we're like hiking around in wet feet. So kind of a bad thing today. So to recap, uh, this morning I would have been broken up by the rat jumping on top of my sleeping bag, but uh, I was already awake because there were dogs howling since 2 a.m. to 6 a.m. constantly. So Kurt and I uh, got up and chased the rat around the room. That was fun. <laughs> and. Uh, what else happened today, Kurt? Anything notable? Other than pain and agony, lots of climbing up and down. It's like a good eight hours. We left at seven thirty, and it's now four o'clock. So we've been on the trail all day. Hurt like hell. We'll see how we feel tomorrow. Mm. Uh, we saw that when we stopped for our well. It yeah, wasn't really. Camera, put your camera yourself so you oh. see it on. There you go. Pull back, pull back. Yes. So, when we stopped for, well, it's not really lunch, but when we stopped to get something to eat, um, we ordered apple pie, but they ran out, so we got like deep fried candy bars. And I was supposed to tell them those deep fried candy bars on this trip, dude. Let's tell them just eating double black and then sex. <laughs> and you walk out there in the Himalayas now. <laughs> Haven't I taught you anything? <laughs> All right. That's uh, the only thing I can think of that's notable. Like, who would have thought of deep frying candy bars? Well, they're trying to peel the Western taste, but fortunately, candy in the Nigeria's rotting out children's teeth because. I mean, they don't really have the dental uh, cash, please, cash. <laughs> hey. <sighs> okay. It's like uh, 5 o'clock in the morning, 5.30.
hurts feeling really nauseous. So I don't know if we didn't knock the bug out of them completely before. Maybe we took them off the Cipro too soon. Or, um, you know, he was running a fever, fever last night with 99 degrees. And then this morning it seemed to have, I mean, uh, yesterday morning it seemed to have shown what day it is. Two nights ago he had a 99 degree fever. Cleared up in the morning. Didn't have the runs anymore. So I uh, took him off the Cipro, but maybe that was a mistake. I don't know. So uh, it could be gluten. I mean, he's gluten intolerant. Uh, we think he might be gluten intolerant. I mean, his mother is. We've had some gluten on the trip, and after being gluten free for months, I mean, that can mess up your system too. But no matter what it is, Kurt's uh, feeling pretty miserable right now. Well, it's uh, 97, so doesn't look like you got fever. What do you think, buddy? Should we uh, lay low for a day? I just want to like kind of rest a couple hours. We'll get up, see how you feel. and you vomit, will you feel better? Yeah, I think you will. Just want to try and throw up and get it over with. I had something to wash out my mouth. Really, we should start just filling up both liter bottles and just keeping them there purified for tonight. I got one right here, right? Yeah, but there's barely anything left in it now. Okay, just rest there a minute and I'll uh, purify some water. Okay. We'll see what we can do, okay? Sorry, I'm feeling well. is the uh, village of Tao. Start eating again. How you feeling, buddy? It's alive. It's alive. It lives. Looking pretty comfortable in that seat, bag. Even though that's where you spent the night. <laughs> <laughs> 